Hey everyone, tonight I'm doing a Risk of Rain 2 Monsoon Captain Run. I quite like the Captain, I like hacking stuff and getting stuff for free, not having to wait. I have uh, no attention span, no patience whatsoever, uh, so I like getting that stuff for free. And getting a legendary <laughs> legendary chest, I cannot speak for free, is always quite nice. Might as well, I don't know if it's going to be good timing, probably not. But I got a poly loot as my first item, so that's... <laughs> We're off to a great start right away. People do say I have insane luck in this game, but I don't I don't know what it's like to live in other people's bodies, so I don't know how true that is, but I guess we'll find out tonight. That's also a scrapper on... <laughs> I'm good at pinging. That, that's a bad sign for my aim coming out. Alright, watch this. Tracking, that's gonna hit right there. And then... Okay, well... It's the first ever Risk Rain 2 video I'm ever recording. Chronologically, it's not going up first, but this is the first one I have, uh, I have ever done, so... That's uh, quite exciting, and if I completely mess up all of my words and everything, now you know why. And I promise you from here on out, it's not really going to get that much better. I'm still going to mess up everything I say. So, <laughs> if you're in too deep already, I apologize. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm going to scrap this left on Daisy. You already know. Wow, I proc so much. Like, is, is this just Captain? I have not played Captain in a long time. I guess it is. I guess it is. Although I've never had poly loot on stage one with Captain, so... I'm not going to buy this. I've worked so hard to get all my lunar coins, I can't even imagine what it feels like to part with them. So, we're going to say goodbye to that one for now. It's just too precious to me. I do love Captain, though. This shotgun, this mouse one. Because, let's be honest here, Captain is just mouse one. That's all. Oh, that is amazing. I don't have any inbuilt movement, so having that is great. Captain is literally just mouse one. Because this move, I mean, once you get deep enough, it doesn't, it doesn't even matter. And then this move is just a shotgun. That is uh, also a sniper. And for a character that is just Mouse 1, for them to make him still feel super fun, I think is a testament to how amazing the Risk of Rain 2 devs are. Uh, I really do love this game. I've been playing Risk of Rain 1 uh, since that was a thing. And so when Risk of Rain 2 came out, of course, I instantly was like, I'm getting this in beta. What is this? Can I see? It, that's not what I want anyway. I can tell that much from the shape of it. Uh, I might as well just do the teleporter right now. I don't know where things are. You're going to notice I get lost a lot. I am not the best player at all. If you guys have any tips on how I can improve, please let me know. Don't be afraid to backseat too much. Um, actually, be afraid to backseat too much, but don't be afraid to not backseat enough. And then uh, let me know how I can improve my pacing and stuff and everything. And I'm actually going to save one of these beacons because there is some cheese I can do on a boss. Oh, that is perfect. Uh, with this beacon, I believe. I don't exactly know how to do it optimally, but there's a way you can shoot like super fast if you go like this. So, we're gonna find out about that if I click a little bit faster. I'm not known for my clicking speed, but that's okay. My sensitivity is super low, so if you hear me going like this, that's why. I need to move my entire arm just to move around the map. I think I actually saw the teleporter. I don't remember where it is. Yeah, I have goldfish memory, zoomer brain, no patience like I said and uh, no ability to have any kind of recall memory. So if that's annoying and you're like, why is he not getting that chest? That's right there, it's so annoying. Don't worry, I, uh, I have to live in my own head. So trust me, every qualm that you have with me, I have it worse. I have it worse. Let's just kill this boss real quick. Uh, I'm hoping I can also do some Eclipse runs in the future. I uh, have never played Eclipse before, and I never really had a reason to. I wasn't like, oh, I want to play Eclipse right now. But uh, clearly by the way I play, I don't really care about taking damage much. Oh, wait, let's, let's try this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is this? Okay, I am, I, I don't know what to tell you. I guess I am just very lucky. Uh, I <laughs> appreciate the file that you gave me for screen two devs. You knew I was recording. I hit you up in Discord. Don't worry, the bank transfer is coming in through Zell. Real quick. I've had a pretty busy day today. I, today's actually the day I can actually mention this because this is going up far in the future where I left the Brahalla partner program. I am no longer a Brahalla partner, a partner creator. Uh, I made that whole video explaining when in the future. I wrote the script tonight. I was going to do the voiceover. Uh, I recorded the footage I needed for it, but uh, I got too tired to do the voiceover. So instead of doing that, which is something that I've done a hundred times, a commentary voiceover for Brahalla. I am doing something entirely new that I have never done and trying it for the first time because logic does not apply to me in my own head. I don't know why. I wish I did. If I did, this might make a bit more sense, the decisions I make in game. Mostly that one. And that's okay. That's fine. I also don't play with sound at all normally. I have uh, I usually listen to Vsauce in the background, which is what I used to do. Excuse me. 
Had some, uh, I don't even know what I had for dinner. That's crazy that I don't. Had some pork, that's what. I might be burping a bit. But I, uh, I, I, I played Risk of Rain 1, and I was listening to Vsauce videos in the background, and now I play Risk of Rain 2 and listen to Vsauce videos in the background, so I really have not grown as a person since middle school, when I was a young child. And now, as a slightly older child, I still have the same issues. I did not manage my gold well. I could get that, but I don't think it's even worth it. I'm just gonna go to stage two. It's already five minutes in. I got enough items. I got a poly loot. I got this defensive microbots, which is like the best item in the game. Not really, but I mean, it's up there. It's definitely up there. And then uh, I got some scrap. I'm a scrap addict, so you're probably gonna see me do that a lot. I'm gonna hope that I get I don't even know what map. I kind of want to get the, the red map. I don't know the names of any map. You're going to <laughs> like learn this very quickly. I don't know the names of any map in the game. I got, I think, super lucky with my timing with this last time, so I'm going to try for it again. I don't know if there's like an actual timing for that. I do know the actual timing for that, but I chose not to do it on purpose. I'm not going to get safer spaces. Not the biggest fan of it. I kind of like the teddy bear more because I walk into damage like crazy. But I might mix things up a little bit. Why not? I could get... That could be a void build today. This poly loot is proccing like crazy. Can you even imagine with this, with the, uh, <laughs> the clover? That'd be crazy. All right. I was, I was mentioning something. I was talking about something. It doesn't really matter. I, I don't really care too much about what I was saying. Why are there only three void enemies? Did I, did they, what happened? Why are there only three? That's not normal, right? There's normally way more. I don't know. I'm able to snipe them though. From afar. You're gone. Oh, you are already gone from this blind pest. And then kill you. Kill you. And I would like some more movement, please. I don't like being slow. Again, I'm a very impatient person. I should probably use my hacking beacons. I'm now reassigned. I didn't even do it. There we go. God, that is a lot of fun. It doesn't even matter, though. Captain already does so much damage that you don't even need to cheese like that. It's, it's, like, it's totally fine just to be a normal human. Get that. I asked for more movement and more movement they gave me. I could use some healing right now. If you don't know, you can get a bit of healing by standing in that. Much like the monsters, it's kind of like a healing for everyone. You get healing, you get healing, everybody gets healing. Where are these guys? I should have used my thing. I'm gonna take damage. I'm, I think I have a plan. This is gonna work. If I stand up here, I have just enough height. Please work. It did nothing, it did nothing. It did no damage. This would have been so much smarter. Cause then I could I wouldn't have to jump down. I was being so fancy. Actually, can I just, just jump up here? I am very intelligent. Okay, all right. I should use my hacking beacon real soon. Oh, the teleporter's right here. Um, let me explore the map a bit then. I'm not using these hacking beacons optimally. This whole thing, well, I can't even say beacon, so that makes sense. Lines up. That, they have a move where you can blast you away. Today I learned, all right. Um, you're gonna learn that I'm not a very optimal player, but it's okay because apparently if you get a poly loot on stage one <laughs> And then a bunch of movement items on captain including a hapu feather, then you're totally okay Let's See what these two are gonna be. I might I mean I might as well, right? I might as well I'm not even gonna use all my gold this round. What am I doing? I was trying to theme this video around hacking and instead it's just I shouldn't even worry about trying to theme things I don't even know what I'm doing yet this is my first attempt at a commentary, and it's turning out terrible. It's turning out... Honestly, it's not even turning out that bad. This is this is, this is is what I expected. This is fully what I expected. I hope it's what you expected, too. And if it's not, I am sorry to disappoint. I tried my best, I promise you. I really did. Give me something that I want. Give me, like, a, uh, a an eccentric vase. Or Gubo. Of, of course I'll take a Gubo. Can Gubo hack things? That is what I want to find out. That is, uh, that'll be exciting. No. I could just swap right now for the whatever I had, the ocular hood. I don't want to go back. I never want to go back to where I was before. We're going to say hello to this boss. We're going to say goodbye to this boss. I'm talking, I'm talking Beatles, all right? That song. If you don't know, every time they, they use rhymes, they use the sound of every single one of the, uh, the vowels to do rhymes because the words are quite simple and simplistic. So the more you more you learn every day. Why is that coming to my brain? I don't know. But I, I forgot I could do that. I was hoping that I was gonna get a band there. Because that would have been that would have been a nice little connection that I made. But regardless, that's okay. 
things don't always work out the way you want them to work out. Oh, Gubo is like better at aiming the the thing than I am. I don't know how that works though, because the ship only has three shots, right? So how is Gubo accessing more shops than the ship? Does Gubo clone the ship that the laser beams spawn from? Or the explosions, rather? That would be impressive. I didn't notice that. That could give me a red, right? I would love a red right about now. Oh, another red, I should say. I would also love a scrapper right about now. I would not love a squid polyp, to be perfectly upfront with you. But that's all right. I still uh, am doing quite well. This run should not be losable if I'm a good gamer. I should be fine. And surely nothing will go wrong. But we're going to hope that uh, I still get some good items because who knows what I'm capable of. I almost never kill Mithrix on stage 6. I always loop until eternity and then get so bored that I just like alt F4. That's what happens every time I play this game. But uh, today's the day that I fight Mithrix right away. We're going to speed run to him. Or as much of a speed run as this is. 11 minutes on stage 2. So not much. I'm just going to get this and I'm going to leave. I have so much money that it's a problem. I'll take that. I'll take that off your hands. Why not? Is there a blood shrine that I can cheese out right now? No, there appears not to. You can stand here? Oh, I guess not. But the thing can spawn there? Interesting. The war banner. I'm not a war banner fan. Maybe in simulacrum. But I'm not much of a simulacrum player. We got the sulfur pools. The other yellow map. Um, let's see. What do I really want here? Like, what do I absolutely could not live without? Maybe a, a recycler would be nice. Not getting that, though. That's okay. Gas I could use. I could use some gas. That would be great. I could do this alternate, and I reset my M1 cooldown. If you don't know, every time you use the mouse 2, you can reset your M1 cooldown. You can also do it by <laughs> doing this. But you kind of have to aim at the sky for that one, because you can't really aim at the ground. Otherwise, it's going to use your beacon. Not that it really matters for me not using them anyway. And could I use it there? Absolutely. Am I going to? Absolutely not. What do you think this is? Playground? Kitty little playground? I need handouts. I need to get stuff for free. I don't need to get stuff for free. Not me. Nothing here, unfortunately. I don't hear the music at all. Am I crazy? Am I am I just an insane person? Very professional, by the way. I guess the music of Risk Rain 2 does go in and out according to the mood. That is... I love to see that. All day, every day. Scrap into my heart's content. I don't know, I'll use you. Why not? Maybe not the most optimal, but it's better than not using it. So, I would love the red map in the next level. I was going to say red mevel, but that is not proper. That's fine. That's honestly fine. Not what I wanted, but certainly uh, won't complain about that one. And I'm going to search. I'm going to do a bit of perusing. You didn't spawn yet. For something nice. This... Poly loot, this single item is going to carry my entire run. What is this? Tougher times? Not bad. Did I pick up the scrap that I scrapped? What did I even scrap? I'll take that. I don't know. Can I get both of you? No. Both of you little boys. I do not want that. So I'm going to pass. What is this? 120. Chess are 120. That's a lot of money. Sorry. I don't know what's going on tonight. Like I said, I mean, it's 1.13 a.m. right now, so if you want to do the math of when I started, that's a little bit of simple subtraction, but a simple calculus. And I am actually lacking out on damage right now. What do I really want? Some crit would be great. An ATG would be fantastic. I don't think I even need to bother about you. Let's check underground what's going on. <sighs> Might as well. Get this. Hit you. Band? I could use a band. If I hit someone with these uh, these explosions. Will of the Wisp is also quite good. Alright, we're getting some damage. We're getting some damage. Ask and you shall receive. Uh, unfortunately, there's there's like not that many chests. Am I crazy? Or am I just blind? Because I don't see anything. That's fine. I don't care. Uh, I never cared. Can't hit this guy. Something up here? No. Just a little mini, mini thing there. And now the music's hitting. All right, we're gonna calm down a bit. Thank you, Chris. And I guess I take the teleporter with 376 gold. I don't know where anything is. 
I am as blind as these pests, unfortunately. I do need to get my eyes checked out. And another one of the bungus. Just what I needed. Just what I needed. I guess there's some stuff there. I never picked up the scrap, okay. Well, I'm gonna go back and scrap anyway. Okay! I could use that. Why not? And then you're gonna fly away, like, right now. That's fine. Still hit. Still hit. The Will of the Wisps doing damage as well. I don't think I can hit you right now. Thank you, Tesla Coil. It's like, I just start feigning. Faking that my mood is lowering because I don't have any blood sugar because it's so late at night and my body is just needing to burn all of the m molecules in my body to stay awake and my brain is not fast enough to keep up with my speech. And then the game just gives it to me. If you complain, you get what you want is the lesson of the day. So, goodbye you. And now we wait once again. This is my um, least favorite part of the game is waiting for the teleporter. In fact, most of the time I play with a mod that when you kill the boss, the teleporter just instantly charges. Which does make the game a lot easier, but uh, I'd rather not have as big of a challenge. That's actually not true. I do miss that uh, the clock ticks up very quickly, which I guess I could also do with mods. But regardless, I am so impatient. Like this, this, this just, this just kills it for me. I gotta, I gotta do something to make this go faster. Maybe I get a focus convergence, but then I, again, I would have to part with my lovely blue coins, which I'm not willing to do. So I don't know. I don't know. Is my Tesla coil also proccing the polyloots? That's how that works, right? Everything, every new instance of damage can proc something unless it's at the, like the end of a chain, something like that. I don't know. All right, what do I get rid of? Squids, I'm sorry. I could get rid of the Bungus too. Do I have healing? Do I have other healing? It, do it doesn't really matter. Get rid of the Bungus. Um, do I want those tougher times? I could use the tougher times, but I promise I will never get hit again. So I'll be fine. And I, this whole stage was quite a stinker for me, wasn't it? I guess I did get the Tesla coil, but I'm gonna need to do something big here to make a comeback. There's a chest, that's good. Didn't miss out on everything. 120 gold, another gas, why not? I'm just gonna leave. Anything else I wanna get rid of? Eh, not really. Not particularly. I think I'm good with where I'm at. Damage myself. Ignore what I said previously. And Sundered Grove. Okay, I'm fine with this. I just gotta find the red chest. Or the legendary chest, rather. Uh, there's only five enemies in this void seat. I feel like that's so little. Am I crazy? Or are there, like, supposed to be way more enemies in the void seat? I don't know. Oh, you're... <laughs> you're doing something there. You're doing something there. You should just sign up for the NBA dunk contest with those hops. That was a bad, that was, I don't know why I said that. Come down here. I can't hit you if you're up there. I want what's down here. All right, whatever. I'm going to look for the chest. Because the earlier I, and then, of course, of course, you listen to me now. Is this what it's like to be a parent? I need to call my mom. That's going to kill some stuff. All right, the void seed collapses. Please be right here. That would be, that would make my day. I don't know what to say. Is there much here? There's this which gives gold, right? The stock. And then there's the... I have another try at this. Ready? It's gonna be... Now! Of course, after I scrapped my bungus. I'm fine with only one, honestly. It's not a big deal. Not a biggie. Not a biggie. I cannot believe this poly loot. It's the first item I got. In the first video I ever made for a screen 2. That's crazy. I have a feeling this might get nerfed eventually, though I don't know. It's not like the game needs to be super balanced. It's, uh, you know, kind of about having fun, getting super OP. I didn't really need this Gore's Tomb, to be honest. I'm leaving every map with a billion gold anyway. Not like I'm using it optimally. Alright, please be up here. Uh, not the right. Not, not where I thought I'd go with that. How do people feel about Sundered Grove? If I'm playing someone like Loader, Sundered Grove is like a jungle gym. I do love Sundered Grove. And if I'm playing anyone else... You know, a lot of people complain, I think, about Sundered Grove. I go, although, I guess I don't really know. I'm not really too involved with the Risk Ranger community. Although, I would love to be more so from here on out. I think that would be fun. But uh, from what I hear down the grapevine, people don't really like Sundered Grove. And I don't know. The way I feel about it is, like, it's a torture that I wouldn't wish on anyone. So, even my worst, most vile enemies. I don't know if that's the general consensus. But it is big and large, and I am impatient, 
Didn't really need that. Get rid of it. And find this legendary chest. I'm gonna hope it's up here. Because if it's not, it means it's either down there. Oh, also my textures are so low that I can't tell where the flowers are. I'm realizing that now. If this doesn't look pretty to you and you want me to turn textures up, please let me know. And uh, I just do it for performance. It's kind of like Team Fortress 2. I don't actually know what the normal game looks like. I've always played with low textures. The moment I installed it, I played with low textures. Because I just assumed that I should. Maybe that's a bad assumption of mine. Please be here. Thank you! Oh, thank you for being a friend. Alright, let's find this teleporter. Oh, and it's right here. The game is blessing me after that horrid stage 3. And they're sending a bunch of these guys at me. That I can't hit, but it doesn't matter. I have an auto-aiming <laughs> electric coil. And, uh, where was that? Where were, the, where were the little particles? Oh, there they are. Oh, this music is bumping. This music is bumping. Give me a uh, TP. Find some more chests. I don't think I've been looting super well this run, but I feel like the loot has been super good. So it's kind of um, been fine. It's been okay. My, my microbot's gonna get rid of these things, right? Does it get rid of it? Yeah, it does. <gasps> Why I got pushed in. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Nobody panic. I could have also stood beneath the teleporter, I think. Thanks for the money. I didn't even need to use my hacking beacon, honestly. You make so much money off of gut. It doesn't even matter. Alright. Just mash. Can you hear the clicking? Did I cancel my sky beam? Skynet? Probably did. You can't hit me. Oh, they're so terrible. It's so sad. Imagine being this bad. I wouldn't want to be you wandering vagrant. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. What did I get? What am I gonna get? It would be nice if it was an ATG. And I became a wandering vagrant. I guess that is karma. I guess that is karma. I deserve that. That's fine. I'm fine with that. Maybe I put myself at low HP against Mithrix on purpose. And then I do a supernova boom. To KO myself and him at the same time. What happens if you die like the same frame that you killed him? Does it just say killed by the planet? I bet it does. I bet it does. I guess I wouldn't know. Some lore master might be able to tell me. Charging this TP quite quick. You know, when you actually fight stuff. And when you're talking, I'm not paying attention. I didn't miss. They can actually go by quite fast. It's just when you're standing there in the late game. Stage 40. And everything's insta-dying anyway. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. <laughs> I didn't need to. Thank the lord. Alright. Aegis! That's actually what, just what I wanted. I looked in the mirror this morning and I thought to myself, you know what would make my day way better? Is if I waited and searched for upwards of four or five minutes for a legendary chest and then I got an Aegis out of it when I didn't have healing items. And thankfully, that's exactly what I got. So, I am in... Is that a crowbar? Tri-tip? Honestly, not too bad right now. Tri-tip. I can use a tri-tip. I'm just gonna kill these guys, right? Yeah, I have the second poly loot. I have the Tesla coil. I can just kill them by standing still. I don't even need to shoot these. The thing does it for me. The music on this map is really good if I remember correctly, if I recall. Can I snipe this? Did it stop in the midair? Does it have range? Or did I just miss? I think I just missed. I think I just missed. That one was a warning shot. And so were those. And they didn't listen. And look at them. Look at them. So helpless. So helplessly in pain. I actually don't do much damage at all. Uh, I'm gonna need something. There's another Void Seed. What is going on? What is going on? That didn't miss either. Maybe I can get this Void Jailer to kill like everything around it. That would be great. I can't freeze these guys, can I? Stun them? Oh, I can. That looks awkward. Why am I getting close to it? <laughs> It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. Don't worry. I've never lost a run to a Void Jailer. It's fine. <laughs> Today won't be the day. Please. Please, 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 please. You're taking a lot of damage. There's a lot of hit markers, but I'm not doing that much damage. You know, maybe I do need, like, bleed. Bleed stacks. Oh, they got their safer spaces back. Uh... Please die. And where did it go? Oh, there it is. Okay. We're reaching the point of Risk Rain 2 where my scaling is not as fast as the things around me, and then it's gonna turn into a bit of a slog and a bit of a grind fest, which I don't want. I'll take you, why not? 
And so I'm gonna hope, oh, you are unfortunately placed. I am so sorry for you and your house of honor and your legacy. Might as well get two free items, why not? Why did I double jump? I didn't double jump, that's fine. I don't take full damage, ever. And you take a mountain shrine every time. Every time. Where's this last opponent? This opposer of mine. It's another little boy there. And what did I get? I got one of these pick three. Void Cradle, is that what it's called? What am I gonna get? Honestly, I'd prefer that over Teddy Bear. Because, again, I'm not going to take any damage. I already got a defensive microbot. That's going to do a lot of work for me. So I don't have to worry too much about taking that much damage. I don't think. And against Mithric, I mean, it's the same thing every time. I I'll never get hit, right? <laughs> I should have taken that teddy bear. I and I missed everything. Uh, it doesn't even matter. The run, run is unlosable now. So. You know. I don't know why I'm getting so many void stuff. Last run I played, I got nothing. In like 12 different runs. Ooh, Soldier Syringe would actually be nice. Because then I could just proc my Polyloot more, right? I think Soldier Syringe is the play here. And there's bound to be a Scrapper, so... If I see anything else that's better, I can just get that. I think Syringe is the play. I think this will help me out a lot. And then I can also defend faster. Yeah. Getting some Syringes on the Captain's thing always looks nice. That... Jellyfish always looks funny. That's my favorite part of the screen too, is that when you get items, they appear on your character. It's it's so nice. It's so great. It's such an intelligent design choice. You just feel more powerful and you like look more ludicrous and stupid. There's also a mod that every time you get stacks of stuff, it adds stacks of it to your character model. That's pretty funny. Modding community in Risk Rain 2 is, is super great. Yeah, I do want to get involved in the community more. I don't know how to, so I, I will just post a video and then hope that people watch it. <laughs> Which, it's like 40 minutes uncut, so that, <laughs> probably nobody will, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm gonna get one of these utility chests right over here, and I have so much gold, and another hacking beacon, and I don't know where anything is on this map. Maybe there's some chests over here. I did not explore over here yet. Oh, there's another shrine. I can use my hacking beacon on that shrine, and where's the other shrine that I hacked? Oh, okay. Right over here. I don't know how to skip pillars with the with the egg. Can I do it with one? I don't think you can do it with one, a captain. Although maybe you can. I don't know. I do also have two extra jumps. I would love to skip pillars if I can. A vase here would be incredible. I'm losing my mind. Oh, milky chrysalis. That's probably better than the egg, right? For getting up there. Though I guess I wouldn't know. There's some like weird geometry on the pillars that you can latch yourself onto, but I don't know where it is. I have much to learn about this game, but I'm I'm very open and willing to. If people would be so nice as to indulge. Um, I might as well do TP now, I think. Methinks that is probably the play. Oh, the other thing was the bleed. The bleed would have been good, but that's okay. Hopefully I get some good here. ATG, bands, grand variant. How much, how many are there? I don't know. I can hit them here, right? Yeah. I should probably be careful of like their sun move because I don't know how I'm going to get out of here. Because I already used my equipment, but that's fine. I do so much damage actually, now that I think about it. It doesn't even matter. I'm just mashing. I, I don't even need to aim. Their hitbox is so big. Uh-oh. 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 Maybe if I kill this thing first. I can kill this thing quickly, right? I don't even know what that move does. Like, what is this icon right here? I don't know. I don't know how the grandparents work, if I'm going to be honest. Because I don't have any of my own. That's not true. Did I get sucked in there? I don't know. But I just want to avoid the big things, usually, is, is what I found to be a good way to play. Alright, I got my Milky Chrysalis, so if they start doing it, I can leave. I can get close without worrying too much. They're just throwing rocks. Okay, they're starting to do it, but I can kill them first. No worries here. Last one. I can definitely kill this before it finishes, right? So... Might as well just stay in the teleporter range, do a bazillion damage up close. Everything's A-OK. -okay. Oh, this guy is so toast. This guy is so toast. Be good. Um, that's getting scrapped. Did, was there a scrapper on this map? I hope so. Because I would love to scrap a lot of this stuff for a red item. That would make me very happy. That would make me exceedingly happy. 
I actually do like the harpoon in like normal gameplay. I think it feels super fluid with a lot of characters, especially railgunner. Harpoon on railgunner is just great. But not gonna help me much when fighting a final boss that I cannot KO to get this proc. Or to trigger, I think is the proper term for that. Tesla coil might be dangerous against Mythrix, but I can stay long range and just snipe with my M1, I think. And fly up high in the air. Wow, I do a lot of damage with poly loots. Crit poly loots. How much crit do I have? I have two glasses. It's a 20% chance. Do I have a scythe? I do have a scythe. 25% chance. Not bad. One in every four. So, still gonna be a good amount of damage. It's probably gonna boost it by about 25%, if I were to guess. Based on just those odds. But I'm not, I'm not a numbers guy. Not really too much of a in-depth into that. Alright, let's zoom across this map. Let's find something good. Did I already get those items? I think I did. And, uh, I need, I need like, I don't know. Something. Some kind of scrapper. Some kind of vase. Although I have the milky chrysalis. That's the syringe, right? Yeah, I did get those syringes. I think that's quite lucky. Oh, that's not bad. That is not bad, but I think I'm gonna take the chrysalis and then just try to get up the pillars. People might already know, it's like, oh, you can't do it with this setup that you have. And they're just punching themselves, cringing at my ineptitude. That's that's pretty good. But I am not knowledgeable in those areas. It's all quiet now. It's like building up to the final battle, I guess. Which is interesting. Drones on Captain are also really good. They all inherit your defensive microbots, so they can stay alive forever. Starting to lose my voice here. So it's good that it's closing out soon. I don't see, what are you? Okay. I don't see anything here. I don't see any scrapper. I could be blind, but I don't see it. Honestly, would I get rid of that much? I would, yeah, I would. I would hate to lose my shuriken in the, in the pool if I get like a behemoth or something. That would be big. I would hate to lose some of these items. A couple, mayhaps. Getting rid of one of the scythes would be fine, I think. Goodbye. Oh, this activates when you click it. So even when you're charging, you can get like a two hit there. Interesting. All right, vase, vase, pray for a vase. Vase, any vasers? Useless to me, completely. Another chest. Interesting, Topaz Brooch, very good for my Aegis. I love to see that all day, every day. And nothing up here, right? I was already up here, yeah. All right, let's just head home. Let's just head home. Fight the big bad guy, win the video game, and get to bed at a reasonable hour. Somewhat. Somewhat reasonable. I guess I'm losing my energy real quick. You can tell. It's like it's sapping, a, it's sapping away from me. Sapping. Super auto pets. All right. I'm not going to use the milky chrysalis yet. I think what I'd want to do is like aim for the bottom of the little nest that there is. I can also do this. I'm so sorry for your ears. And then, and then hope. I don't have enough movement speed to like trimp, right? I mean, I, I wouldn't even know how to do that. There's some rock you can do. You can also probably do it off that. Uh, I do want to check though. There's 60 seconds on this. I do want to check the red item pool. Hopefully I can get rid of like a, a red whip or something or the harpoons. That would be great. Uh, this chrysalis actually does last a while. Maybe I can get up there. Maybe I can. My three jumps. Possibly. Now I'm just floating down all quiet. I don't hear any music. Is that just me? Hold on. We're gonna let this song build up. Cause that's like the dream of this song, right? That it builds up. All right, please kill. And then I get a burst of speed. Didn't kill. Oh, that's not good. If I don't kill with that, this is gonna be a bit of a grind, I feel. That's okay. That's okay, give me something good here. What is that? I can't tell. Scorpion? Was that a scorpion? 100% trade for a scorpion. I think it was. There's like nothing here. What's going on? What's going on here? It is. That's honestly a run saver. And I only lost one Hapu Feather. And an ATG. Do I have any green sc scrap? I, I mean, I didn't really lose anything I wanted. I might as well get one. Should I? Do I risk it? I mean... Sure. 
Uh, I didn't need gas. That's fine. All right, three is three is probably good. I don't know if I could make it up there, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try at the very least because I don't want to sit here forever. I know there's a side with a little rock formation that's nice, but maybe I can just make it up without there. Let's find out. Let's find out. We're gonna go up here. We're gonna go up here. Oh, I can easily make it up here. I'm just gonna have to wait 60 seconds. That's all. That's all. Oh, <laughs> okay. That that was not the best timing, to be honest. Oh, maybe I could have made it up now. Let's see how, how much time is left. No, I don't think I could have. Maybe though. Anyway, we're just gonna skip ahead. All right, we're ready. What a good song this is. I mean, I that didn't even feel like 60 seconds. That was just that was just remarkable. I'm gonna fight Mythrix now. I could wait another 60, so this is back. What? Song. I didn't know it would cancel out when I fought Mythrix. I guess it's the Mythrix song now, though. Can I freeze him? Okay, I can't. Today I learned. Well, I do have the Scorpion, so hopefully this should go pretty well. I can also do some cheese with my, uh... Pillar- or my beacons? My beacons? Yeah. So, that'll be nice. Don't kill me, please. Did I time that right? Time that pretty well. Nice. Oh my god! I am so good at the game! I have another jump. No, I don't. That was an embarrassment on many fronts. Uh, this is a war on two fronts as well. Don't hit me. Oh, I should wait up here and then he jumps up, right? He's gonna like chase me with his hammer. He's gonna do a hammer dash and then he's gonna, he's gonna fall. That's what's gonna happen there. All right, come here. <laughs> so lonely. Come back here, Mythrix. I'm not done with you yet. This scorpion is like permanent, right? This is like it doesn't wear off like the Shattering Justice would. Is this just better than Shattering Justice? Does anyone know? Oh, I could have done my, my thing. It's okay. I could have timed that a bit better. Maybe. All right, look. He's going to chase up here. Oh, what a fool, Mythrix. You're such a dolt. Ah, oh, what an imbecile. You think you can catch me with your little hammer? No. Oh, that was so perfect. That was such a bait on purpose. I am such a good gamer. In fact, I'm gonna go right into his range because do I care? No, I do not. I did lose one of my bottles, my power elixirs. That's okay. Now he's jumping up. What a fool, Mythrix. I'm gonna run right into you because I can jump over your move. Oh, I thought I had my thing. No worries whatsoever. Not even worried for a second. All right, this is gonna be the freest round ever. Come here. Prioritize the flying guys because these do a gazillion damage to you if you're not careful. Get rid of those guys. Don't even pay attention to the tanks on the ground. Those guys are useless. They're dregs of society. They don't deserve rights. Come here. Up here. Lunar Chimera. Is that what these are called? Oh, I think those are the small guys. I don't know what these ones are called. Let's see. Lunar Chimera is what they were called. I was testing you. How many of you got it right? 98%? That's what I got in my physics final. That's not true. I don't know why I said that. Habitual liar, I suppose. You're gone. And it's only little boys left. This guy's so good against little boys, the captain. Because my defensive microbots can just blow up their death explosion. Like, peace, peace. You gave your life to sting me like a wasp. And then imagine I'm just immune to wasp stings. That's the effectiveness of your attack right there. That was a good amount of damage right away. Apparently they changed his third phase so he does the big giant triangle pizza move differently at different timings. I actually almost got hit there. So I don't know when that's going to happen. Kind of worried. I'm going to be real. He backed up. He actually just backdashed. He's actually backdashing me. It doesn't matter what game I play. All right. He's probably going to do it now, right? Right? Avoid that one. That was honestly a little close. He's going to dash forward with the lasers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going to do a big slam. And then... <gasps> that jumps up. Oh, defensive microbots saving my life. And then there it is. Okay. I actually don't have one shot protection. <laughs> oh, no. I didn't get hit. I didn't get hit. It was someone else. It was someone else. Someone was on my account, I think. Uh, okay. I probably can't afford to get hit again by that. But it doesn't matter. He has so little health. Surely he's not going to get to that phase again. Surely. I've been saying that way too much, haven't I? I have. Goodbye. He's not dead! Please! Please! Okay. Now the real fight begins. Do I just stay here? I think I just stay up here, right? There's nothing you can do to kill me from up here. Right? 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 No! 
Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. Cool, Mythrix. I appreciate it. What happened to my explosion? Does he have defensive microbots? No. I don't have defensive microbots. He has them. He just... He just... <gasps> Ready? Ba ba ba! They disappear! Alright, I need it back. Thank you. Now this is a win. Oh, that is close. That is close. I still have wings, that's funny. Okay, 480 damage. Huge! 29 damage, even huger. That was nice. Oh, Polly, it's GG. It's GG. N try as hard as you can, Mythrix. You can't even hit me. You know what? I'm even gonna go onto the open. There's nothing you could do to hit me. Try as you might, you are a useless opponent to me. <gasps> bring me a real fight! Bring, 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 bring me a real fight! Is you're a real fight? You're you're a real fighter. Please die to this. That'd be funny. It doesn't do much damage at all, does it? Not at all. That's how you unlock the the Diablo strike, right? As you kill with that. All right. I think I can actually. I think I can. A Tesla coil. I have Tesla coil. I don't want to kill with Tesla coil. I think I can with, I, I don't want to overshoot it, but I don't want to undershoot <gasps> He's going to die. No, 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 no. Don't avoid it. Okay. Hacking to victory. How does it feel to get hacked? And we're teabagging on him. That is embarrassing, Mithrix. That is so embarrassing. Imagine losing to a beacon. A beacon that doesn't do damage. It's not, it's not a healing beacon. It's not a stunning beacon. Actually, imagine being so useless. Wow. Mythrix, it's embarrassing. You should... You should hide your brother for me. Alright. I can't, I can't... I can't get up here! Speaking of embarrassing. Alright. You know I have to, right? You know I have to. I got the Milkly... Mil Milkly? Milkly Chrysalis? So I can... I can take this Shrine of Order, right? If I can get up there. If I can get up there in time. I don't even know where it is. I've never done this before. On the old commencement I did. It's not even here, it's there! Oh, I'm so good at the game, it's insane. I have enough time, right? Time isn't counting down or anything. There's no music- <gasps> No way did I just fall through the tiniest hole in the world. I guess the Voidling sometimes, but that was crazy. Where is this thing? It's up here. All right. <sighs> Give me something good. Give me something good. Please! How do I- I guess these don't... How fast am I? Not- that was- that's the most underwhelming Shrine of Order I have ever- I can't jump twice! Shrine of Order. I think I've ever done. And it's the first time I've ever done it on this map. That's not a good sign for the future of me. I'm gonna die to one of these explosions! Um... Wait, I have Larva. I can die. I, I don't mind. I'm fine. Well, this was the first ever Risk of Rain 2 video I've ever uploaded. I have, uh or even recorded and created. I have now realized that my energy tends to dwindle when it's almost 2 a.m. and we're nearing the end of a run. And uh, I probably should not even keep this one up. But I think it's valuable information for me to look back on and see in many years how I've grown and look at the cute little lad that I thought I was when I was younger, you know? So despite this probably being terrible, I think it's expected for it to, you know what? It's expected for it to be terrible. The first- No way, no way I respawn and then I get hit by another one. <laughs> I think it's expected to be terrible for the first- Am I- do I have enough time? I think so. Regardless, I hope you enjoyed this first ever session. I really wish that this end sequence was just you go to the ship and then it ends right away because this is very underwhelming, if I'm going to be real with you. But at the very least, I hope you had a good time. I got my beacons back. I actually killed Mithrix with beacons. So, that was fun. And, good night, everybody. Goodbye.